out of it. All right, guys. So you're gonna hear some wind. You can see up behind me here, there's some clouds, but the sun has actually came out. So what does a guy go do when there's a creek full and a four-wheeler? Well, I'll tell you. The other day, I pulled a dumbass. I went back there and there's just, all this water ran down and there's the mud came with it. And, well, it, it dried out a couple days. Thought nothing of it. Thought, well, hell, I'll just drive across this just to see what it did, you know, just for the fun of it. Well, I started across this little silt piece and Oh, I found out way different what happens when shit hits the fan. I got half across it and just felt the whole side of the floor just sink. So I got mud all my floor. But there's a creek running and I don't feel like washing it. So I'm gonna go have a little wash, a little bit, I'm gonna do a little splish splash and taking a bath. Cause she's a little bit, a little bit nasty. The rims are, the rims are special. So I'm gonna run down there, run through the creek a couple times, get cleaned up. Then we'll see the aftermath.
Cleaned up the underbody, all the underbody's cleaned up, motor's been cleaned up, tires been cleaned up, top body. I washed it off and got a little more mud back on it. That's all right. Well, I'll wash it up again real good and get everything, make sure everything's good and ready on it. Uh, it's a good little four wheel, it's fun. I can't wait to get my new one. My new one's real nice with this one here. I'll still ride this one some, but the new one will get rode a lot more. But Gonna take care of them both. I play with this one a lot, so this one here's got a little bit of wear, I reckon, on it. I play with it. I I've ran this one a lot here recently, but anyhow, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and we'll catch y'all on the next one.